Big story at four construction zone crackdown. Dozens of drivers are nabbed on I-94 in Racine County. Some caught going 20, 30, even 40 miles per hour over the speed limit. Our Evan Peterson is live with the effort to try and get people to just slow down, Evan. That's exactly right there, guys. I'm here at a way station in Racine County. This, well, you recognize this. This is I-94. We've been here for a while now, and we've seen cars speeding up and down these roads. Many of these cars riding the tails of the cars in front of them. Racine County Sheriff tells me that this is exactly the problem. Cars driving way too fast in a construction zone, not paying attention to other drivers. For these construction workers, the side of the interstate is their office. And just feet away, cars traveling at speeds of 60 plus miles per hour. There's been a lot of accidents and, and a lot of speeders, and we have been preaching for our community, our motoring community, our visitors to slow down, pay attention, stop following so closely. A warning that hasn't worked. Especially in those construction zones, it's 60 miles per hour. We recognize that that is falling on deaf ears. So that's where efforts like this by the Racine County Sheriff's Office came in. On Friday and Saturday and Sunday this past week, we conducted a speed, wa speed wave uh, and we netted a lot of speeders. On those three days, they wrote more than 100 citations for various traffic and equipment offenses. 77 drivers were issued tickets for speeds of 80 to 89 miles per hour. Two drivers got tickets for speeds of 95 to 99 miles per hour. And finally, two drivers received citations for speeds of 100 plus miles per hour in a construction zone. You have to have a death wish at those speeds in a construction zone. Well, this effort caught a lot of people speeding. The sheriff says it's not clear if this message was strong enough. I firmly believe we got back to the basics. If people just slowed down, allowed yourself enough time to stop. The life you save may be your own. Now, those who may be painfully aware at this point right now, if you get caught violating any laws in a construction zone, well, the fines double. So those people who were cited over the weekend, they may be having to pay fines upwards of $600 or more. Reporting in Racine County this evening, I'm Evan Peterson, Fox 6 News. Well, and it shows that law enforcement is out there. Evan, thank you.